Hey, bring a trailer. John Seibel here with Seibel's Auto Warehouse, Freeport, Pennsylvania. Bringing you another bring a trailer exclusive from Seibel's Auto Warehouse. Uh, this car came into us from the Florida area. Gentleman had moved from Illinois down to the Fort Myers area or Fort Lauderdale area and said he just couldn't drive his car every day, put the miles on it, wear it out, so he did trade it on a new Acura I LX, I believe is what he said. So we ended up with it from the Acura dealer. Here it is. We're gonna do a walk around today, we're gonna do a cold start, and we're gonna do a drive video. Uh, you know, just showing about the car. First things first, because I know everybody's going to ask, the tires are date coded uh, 2021, so they've been recently replaced. Um, not uneven, no wear marks, no uh, you know, signs of abuse, anything like that. So, walking around the car, I would rate this car at a really strong 9 out of 10. Um, very minor, couple flaws are right on this window belt trim just a little bit of like wax marks um, look maybe a little sun damage just on both rear windows right there Got a bug um, walking around exterior wise very nice uh, 05 and 06 of course has the 6 liter uh, this car is equipped with the 6 speed manual transmission no stone chips to really talk about in the front, except for right in the dead center of the hood right there. That's really minute and touched up. Um, headlights are all in really nice shape. The wheels on this car are exceptional the entire way around. The 6 liter GTO badge on the fender. Once again, like I showed on the driver's side, that belt molding just a little bit dry a little bit of wax residue showing on it uh, moving to the rear the factory rear high-rise spoiler uh, the dual exhaust tips the 04s only had a single outlet in the back the 05 and 06 had the nicer rear one thing and it's kind of hard to see from out here but the seat seams are really nice at the top it's a little hard to see in the tent but Driver seat bolster is very nice, very minimal wear for the 29,000 miles. Uh, GTO factory floor mats front, all on it. Jams are all nice. Pop the hood, you got a really nice stock car. Um, the factory tag there from Holden. All the caution tags on the fans. Emissions, everything stock, manifolds. Everything as far as that goes. Um, factory hood. Really nothing I can tell you real bad about that. We'll leave it open for the cold start here in a second. Going over the passenger side, dual power seats. Uh, has a JVC Bluetooth radio that was upgraded and updated and a short throw shifter and then it has a one piece drive shaft these GTOs had two pieces from the factory there is an aluminum one piece under there that has been done uh, in the back here Got a yellow car cover for storing that's in there. Trunks all like new. The original spare still right down there. I'll tell you what, we'll fire it up. You can take a listen at it.
been sitting on our showroom floor for the past about 60 days. Take it for a spin here, get you a good drive feel for it. Twenty nine thousand four hundred and thirty seven miles at the start of the video. Like I said, upgraded JVC sound. Got the plug in there for your iPhones or your USB. Uh, I know you can't feel because it's a video, but ice cold AC. Let's go ahead. I, GTO did a Pony. I did a really good job with this car. Uh, you know, with the help of Holden and. Everybody else at uh, with yellow stitching in the seats and the steering. And there's uh, not really any other way to say it. yellows really killer co color on this car. Really uh, sets off all the lines. Up, pulls out of the hill here in Freeport without issue. Uh, clutch feels fabulous in it. It's a really well, well kept example of the uh, final year's GTO. Not the final year, but definitely in their best last two years of the 05s and 06s. Uh, with the bigger hammer, six liter in it, six speed manual. The nice thing about the short throat shifter, these factory ones, I used to sell these cars brand new when they came out of the Pontiac store that I ran. These cars always were really sloppy. I mean, the shift pattern, the shift points, everything in these cars were, uh, you know, left a lot to be desired. So the fact that they put the tick short throat shifter and stuff in there is a, uh, you know, tribute to how the guy really kept this car just wanted it to perform at its best in a stock kind of version. Another great thing about this car is just the ease of enjoyment. I mean, this car will uh, go out and perform. You can go out on the weekends, turn the AC on, take your wife with you, and uh, she's going to like everything about the car. You're going to catch compliments everywhere you go with it. Seventy mile an hour, straight, no bumps, no shimmies, no shakes. And for big guys, this car got a lot of room in it. You know, I'm 6'4", 300, and my co-pilot here, he's down to 268, but he's, uh, you know, we're comfortable in this car. They 
shore throw shifter is really nice. It really tightens up the shift pattern on this car all the way. really enjoyable car and honestly these cars are at a value point right now where you know they're sound investments I mean this car is only going to go one way for the next you know 10-15 years if you keep it tip-top shape and you stay keep it up and maintenance up and drivability up I mean this car will be a uh, really sound investment in the long run definitely better than money in the bank where you can go into your garage look at it touch it, feel it, taste it, drive it, pound it, do everything that you want to do, and, uh, you know, the curve will always be there for this car. really just nice, tight, fun car at all speeds. I mean, this car is fun to cruise at 20 mile an hour in a parade. This car is uh, fun to drive at 120 mile an hour on a track. So, the tinted windows were done recently. He did do them after he moved to Florida, he had told me. So this car is going to go back to our shop. It will be sitting in our showroom uh, at the warehouse down here until the uh, lucky lady or gent that ends up winning it on Bring a Trailer hopefully uh, is able to come out, secure it, truck it home, drive it home, whatever that they choose to do. Um, the miles that we quote to you on the video, they'll stay right around there and there'll be nobody I enjoy riding the car. Or out running it unless uh, we let you know ahead of time but uh, we've been doing this a long time we're third generation down here and uh, our family eats sleeps breathes and dreams this business so we really enjoy being able to do what we do because of the folks like you that are bidding on these off the wall hard to find fun cars that we uh, get to deal with every day so We appreciate you taking the time to watch a video. Take a look at our 05 Pontiac GTO. Uh, miles as we pulled in, 29444. Uh, it'll stick right around there. Um, 
We appreciate uh, taking the time. If there's any questions that we can ask, feel free to ask in the auction or through the contact seller button, and we will get back to you as soon as possible. Uh, good luck in the auction, and uh, hope to be putting this in your garage. Thank you very much. Have a good day.